everybody and welcome back to our Let's Play of Pokemon X Part 3 to, or Part 22, Part 3 of our takedown of Lissandre's lab in Pokemon X. And in last episode, we made it to the Lissandre lab and actually ended up um, taking down the admins and the grunts. And we are here to free the Pokemon that's the legendary Xerneas. Whoa! It's coming alive! Whoa! Look at it! That is one magnificent legend. Whoa! Look at that magnificent sprint. Oh my. Whoa, that background's awesome. Okay, so we are not trying to kill Xerneas, we are going to try and catch it. And why Xerneas used that, I have no idea. Now, we are seriously going to try and catch it with a Pokeball. It takes you umpteen times until you're actually able to catch it. We caught him! And only four times! We caught the legendary Xerneas! So Daniel, you can kiss my butt, dude. You can kiss it! Legends say it can share eternal life. It slept for a thousand years in the form of a tree before its revival. Which was now! Yeah, Daniel, I'd like to see you try that. Yes, Ernius will not be in our party. Why, thank you, Shauna. What? Whoa, when did Lissandre get all techied up? Oh yeah, I'm in here. I'm just making a video. Okay. And that was Ed, by the way, you guys. Wait, what? Who do you have that can mega evolve? Come on, Lion, let's do this. Thank goodness I have the Psychic to my type. Come 
Come on, Josh. Let's kick some butt. Hydro pump. Alright, Josh, level 68, buddy. Farron's now 68. Punch crow, huh? Come on, Daisy, let's show these guys up. The time for a change of scenery. Thunderbolt. Doesn't the Thunderbolt look awesome with that electric background? Alright. Let's end this. Wait, what? Mega Gyarados! Oh, snap, crackle, and pop! Wow! We beat a Mega Evolved Gyarados like it was nothing. Yep, only I could pull that off. Well, someone's paranoid. Hmm? The Sandre speechless. Hmm. Uh oh. Yeah, I'd rather not blow up with you. You idiot, you still blast the weapon? Oh crap. Gee, gods. And thus, the legendary weapon shall no longer be used. Dun, 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 dun. I wonder how a lawn manages to deal with this.
Nice. Yes, we'll keep dreaming there, sugar baby. <laughs> hey, it's Az. That's a long, very long time. That is one strange dude. But anyway, let's get our way back to Anastar City. Hmm. Hey, it's Professor Sycamore. Hmm, okay. Okay, kid, whatever. Hey, his name's Jaden. Just like Jaden off of Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. Psychic. <clears throat> Psychic. <clears throat> okay, that's... Alright, that tickles out of my throat now. And Psychic! Okay, we said it right. A uh, friggin' fraggity, fraggity friggin' scholarpede. And in other news, we shall send John out to kick some boote and to test out flare blitz. Whee! Whoa. Was that epic, or was just amazingly strong? <laughs> oh boy. Oh yay, lion level up. Bug types are seriously not the best. The only good bug type in the world is probably a Caesar, and that is the, probably one of the best Pokemon that's a bug type to actually have. I... Okay. Aha! I caught myself there! So Daniel, you can't diss me now, dude. You can't diss me now. Oh! And speaking of Daniel, I know he's probably gonna get back at me in his next video when I say this. But he said he gave a commentary of his Pokemon Y episode 51, and he said my Pokemon X series sucks. Yes, he thinks my series sucks. Oh, Daniel, how you are going to get the hurt when I see you in Florida for my vacation this year sometime. I will hunt you down like a madman. I will make you admit that you are wrong, dude. I take no prisoners, just so you know. 
Or a spear! I thought only Lucario could learn that move. But then again, if I my videos suck, I guess that means, hmm, that you really must love your Magikarp so much. Yeah, here's a personal confession from Daniel to you guys, or from me, from da from Daniel to me and to you guys. Daniel has a personal love for Magikarp. Daniel loves Magikarp. He loves them so much. He actually sleeps with a Magikarp pillow and a Magikarp stuffed animal. And in here... An inverse battle. Wait, so the type that would be effective isn't effective? But the opposite is. So if fighting types were to be used, it couldn't work. Okay, let's try that, shall we? Meteor Mash. Oh, crud. Whoa! But anyway, Daniel loves Magikarp. Daniel really, really loves Magikarp. He sleeps with a Magikarp stuffed animal and a Magikarp pillow. And he also sleeps with Magikarp pajamas. And this is a true story. I actually saw him in Magikarp pajamas last time him and I talked. No! Metagross! Come on, Ellie, we must avenge your little brother. Whoa! I dislike inverse battle. But I guess I had this coming since I was telling you all about Daniel's personal love for Magikarp. Even though he hates Magikarp, he really loves him. He loves him so much, he actually wore a pair of pajamas with Magikarp all over them. Aha! Uh -huh, so that's what does it. I just now realized fighting types are strong against psychic. Aha! Uh -huh, I told you I was a genius, Daniel, and you doubted me. So you can kiss my butt. Grand boy. We'll keep going. Acrobatics. Gee, gads. This is not looking so good for us, people. Come on, Ellie. You can do it, baby. Dragon Pulse. Hopefully this works. All right. We win. We win. We win. We really, really win.
Baron is level 69. Yay, it's a miracle. Well, now we know to never do inverse battle. A oh, citrus berry! Man, dude. Brother from another mother, no, just no. And why did I just save my progress? That's not what I wanted to do. Um. Alright, everybody's all healed up now. So that is inverse battle for you, y'all. Y'all! Hey, it's a hiker. Hi, hiker! Hi, hiker! Stunk fish! I dislike you, fish! I don't know. Uh, I'm just being a goof. Uh, meteor mash, I guess. Revenge, eh? Not <laughs> too bad my defense is super high. Static! Oh, boo that! Boo that all the way to Boo Nation. Instead of the Gene Nation, it's Boo Nation. Boo that too! Thank you, Liam. Hyper Beam! Way to go, Liam! B for victory for you! And we are going to heal you from this paralysis ASAP. I almost spelled another word, and I'm like, uh, nah, I'm not gonna spell that other word because this is supposed to be child rated sense of humor, but then again, it can be teen rated. Uh,. I'm glad I have all those extra healing stuff. Alright, then again, you know what? Let's see what that cave has to offer for us. And then again, let's just stick to the main storyline. This is going to take a while. I'll probably do this as a side screen after the game. But I thought there was a cave that took you to get a free item, I thought. Oh, I was right, it was an HM. And you can see it, it's that little yellow Pokeball over there. Hey, we learned Brick Break! That's cool. And I once remember seeing somebody saying that they hated the Roller Blades. I'm starting to wonder why they would hate the Roller Blades, because they actually do work pretty good. Ah, crap. We can't go that way either. Oh, hello there. Uh, you must be really late for a very important date, like the White Rabbit in Alice in Wonderland.
Come on, Liam. Ah, my arm hurts. Ha ha. Your intimidate ability doesn't intimidate us. So we we shall meet you a mash you now. Cause Graham Bull is a fairy type. FYI to those who did or did not know that. And I may have mentioned that before in one of my earlier videos, but I don't remember to be honest. Ooh, did they? Eh? Um Yeah, let's go to Farron. Earthquake. Haha, <laughs> the dead I missed. Now we will quake you into the earth. 